Greetings, dear chess fans and experts. This is Feedmaster Max Oniev with you. Today, we'll analyze one interesting chess problem, which is extremely hard to solve even for computer engines, but a human can solve it. Let's see what's the deal here. First of all, here's a bit of background information. I saw this chess composition about 12 years ago. At that time, there were chess engines like Fritz 9 and Fritz 8. These chess engines could not solve this problem, even if I set them for a long time. But let's see how modern engines solve this. Here it is, Black's move, and they, strange as it may seem, should try to win. Let's see what, say, Komodo has to show. Here. Look, minus 14.58. All three first lines. This means that it doesn't see a specific win, it just estimates and sees that there's an extra queen, but it doesn't see a specific win. In fact, Komodo finds the right option over time. Let's see now how long it takes to do this. Remember that Komodo is now one of the strongest chess engines on the market. It beats all the grandmasters with ease. But so far, even Komodo hasn't found a solution. And now I recommend you to think for yourself how to win here with black. This is purely at the level of ideas. You need to understand, at the level of ideas, how to win here with black. Catch the right concept and implement it. I recommend you to pause the video and try to solve this problem. So I see now that Komodo still can't solve the problem at the 35th depth of analysis and still can't find the final variation before the mate. It just shows some checks with the same evaluation so it doesn't see any win. Let's try another engine. For instance, let's try Houdini 3. That engine also doesn't see the win at first, minus 13. All the moves are evaluated the same, that means that there is no concrete win. Houdini has been calculating this position for about seven minutes, but also as you can see, it finds no win. Well look, here are the options. If we capture the bishop on b7, for example, then here black just loses because white still has a bishop. The idea here is as follows. We need to first stalemate the white king. Let's do this. For example, we play queen c5. Kind of like this. Let's push the king away little by little. White doesn't want to get stalemated right away, but we'll make them do it. And so we play the queen g3. That's it. We have a stalemate, and white is forced to play bishop c8. But now we can just hit the bishop on c8. White's only move is bishop b7. We play king b8. And after a move like bishop c8, we first check them. For example, queen f3. Then we take away the bishop, and here, of course, we win. It's a simple win, but the engines couldn't find it. Let's find out what's wrong. Maybe there's no closing in on the enemy king, but of course there is. Of course there is, no matter how white plays. For example, the king f5 is played, and we answer with the queen e7. So I'll drive white's king into a stalemate anyway, and I get a win. But after I've introduced all that, let's see if our engine finds a solution now. Let's check Komodo again. Yeah. It finds checkmate in 28 moves, friends. So after I showed the computer how to solve the problem, it figured it out and found the solution. And now in the initial position, it finds mate in 21 moves. Well, that shows that we can still fight with machines, in particular on the chessboard. It's no accident that I chose this particular problem, which symbolizes the weakness of computer engines. This February marked the 26th anniversary of Garry Kasparov's legendary match against the engine called Deep Blue. It was a match against a supercomputer, which had just appeared at the time. Okay friends, thank you for your attention. Please press the like button if you enjoyed this video, and if you want me to analyze in detail the Kasparov vs Deep Blue match, subscribe to the channel so as not to miss the release of this video. I also recommend you to subscribe to our Telegram channel where we post the latest news from the world of chess. So friends, thanks again for your attention, I'll see you soon. The future is not predetermined.